My name is Derek Nipanak, Grand Chief of the Assembly of Manitoba Chiefs. And I'm very honored that Mayor Bowman, the City of Winnipeg, has opened the invitation for the voice of the Manitoba Chiefs through the Assembly of Manitoba Chiefs to be hear heard here today. I do believe that, uh, you know, I've been in different places around the world where if there's not dialogue happening, if there's not communication happening, then there's war happening. And I do believe we should not undervalue the opportunity to come together and to communicate the challenges that we face in the society that we live, that we live within. For thousands of years, Indigenous people have walked on these lands and we've come together through trade and commerce. And in, re in recent times, you know, we've, we've seen the realization of this great city that we call Winnipeg. I'm not here to pacify racism or to provide a politically correct statement on the reality of racism within the institutions that we function within every day. I guarantee that right now somebody is having a racist experience in a restaurant or on the streets in Winnipeg somewhere. And I'm not here to pacify that or to say that it's okay. But what, I'm, what I am here to do is I'm here to acknowledge the great work of people who get up every morning of every day to challenge racism in this city. And you can see many of them standing here with us today. My remarks will be brief and uh, I hope you take this in the right context. I don't really believe we're that special in the city of Winnipeg when you read the particular headlines. I don't believe that racism is strictly a Winnipeg issue. I believe racism is an issue right across the nation, right across the globe. It's a human condition. But what I've said very, what I've said about the city of Winnipeg is this. I believe the city of Winnipeg is an incredibly special place. Uh, a number of months ago I made the statement I said that we really, we need to have a very difficult conversation in our city, respective of race. And the question was posed to me, well, who should start that conversation? Well, I think you're seeing who is starting the conversation today. And I think it's absolutely apropos that our mayor is taking the lead on that. Racism is not a Winnipeg issue only. It's a national problem. And it's not just a, uh, an experience of Aboriginal people. Racism is experienced by many Canadians, people of color, and white people experience racism as well. This is a national problem. We're not going to end racism tomorrow. But we're sure as hell going to try. Everything is just rosy because it isn't. But I also don't want to say stay away from Winnipeg because there's a lot of beautiful things and beautiful people here in Winnipeg and we need to celebrate that. Uh, what I do see with this article and others that uh, have been written by the Winnipeg Sun, the Winnipeg Free Press and others is an opportunity and that's what this article does present. It does place a greater focus on this issue and we can either kill the messenger or we can respond to try to bring out the best in our community and show the nation that we can in fact make tangible progress towards uh, dealing with issues that affect all levels of government and, and all peoples in Winnipeg.